Hey guys, it's Danielle. What's up? So, it's been a while. I know. Well, a while for Bones. Like, I miss it. It's been two weeks, almost. Um, yeah, so I'm in a different room today because I'm in one of my friend's rooms. She has a TV and I don't, and I really want to watch the Olympics. So she's at dance, and her roommate is hanging out with her boyfriend, but I'm here. So, a little creepy, a little weird, I know, but I have permission to be in here, so it's all good. Um, yeah, so it's a little bit weird being in here. Um, my first thing is, spoiler alert, I'm going to be talking about another episode from season one. I'm talking really fast, sorry. Uh, I'll be talking about the woman in limbo today. I really like the woman in limbo. Um, I think it's very sweet. It's really, really sad. But I like how in the end, Booth is there for her and like, and Jared, not Jared, Russ, there we go. Um, Russ is there for her and she knows you know, a little bit more about her family and things that she isn't necessarily proud of, but I just think it's a very sweet episode. I like how um, when they meet uh, Vince McVicker and he keeps calling her Joy, um, I like how Booth just tells her, you know what, I, I know who you are. I know who you are. And I just, that moment, it just, oh, so sweet. I love it. It makes me super happy. <laughs> and I think it's really one of those episodes where the two of them, like, bond. Because in a lot of the episodes, he bickers with her, or they don't get along, or whatever. But in this episode, it's really like, he's there for her, and he's really showing her, you know what? I am totally here for you. I, I'm always here for you. And, sorry, I'm getting distracted. It's men's figure skating. And figure skating is awesome. I love it. Uh, so, yeah. That's pretty much all about that. Um, I really like how you meet Russ for the first time. And um, the whole uh, moment where Bones says something about how Russ was like her hero, and she misses having someone care where she is all the time, and then you hear Booth all, Bones, Bones, where are you? Come on, Bones, we gotta go. I just, I really like that. Um, it is a really touching episode for the whole. Uh, I don't really like that David is back, but I, I kind of understand that without him, Booth wouldn't be all like, ooh, what's in her book, what's in her book? Um, I love how that she's dedicated her book to Booth. I think that's really sweet. And, um, I don't know if I really like how he finds out. I mean, I know there's no real way for him to find out because she's not going to tell him, but I just wish there was a, a little different of a way. But, you know, whatever. Uh, overall, really, really good episode. I never had to watch that one and wait for a season two, which was really nice. Um... I just recently started watching Bones, so that's why. <laughs> like, a year or two ago. So, yeah. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna go because this is getting really long, and I'm rambling, and I'm distracted by <laughs> uh, the Olympics. So, if you have any comments, questions, anything, just put them down there. Right there. See, you type. I type like this, you know. Questions, comments, anything, just let me know. And uh, have a great week until Thursday when I will post again because I can't live without posting. So. <laughs>